This is our window treatment workroom. Uh, we have a lot going on in the window treatment workroom, although I call it window treatment. Um, it's not just the window treatments that we do here. Uh, we do a lot of pillows, cushions, table covers, beddings, um, you name it, anything to do with fabric. Um, we can pretty much do anything custom. Uh, our workroom is really one of the state of the art workroom in the Atlanta area. We have a lot of customers, designers that come in here and they're always very impressed by our workrooms. In fact, I always say our workrooms is more of a showroom than our showroom. Um, just because our all of our equipment, we have all of the electricity and the compressor lines, it's, we had it in the upholstery room, um, all conveniently located, so it provides a lot of efficiency for our, um, our fabricators and our seamstresses. And the more efficient we are, the better um, quality that we're able to provide and better pricing that we're able to provide just because we are uh, so much more efficient and um, our product uh, in the end comes up much better quality. Uh, we have all the equipment to do our work. We have all the sewing machines that does one, every machine does is one thing. You know, we have one machine that just does a straight line, one machine that just does a surging, one machine that just does a tacking but we have all the equipment for the ladies to do the work, um, wh whatever they need. So um, right now we're working on some um, projects. Right here, we just picked up this sofa this morning, and we get a lot of requests to do cushions for either outdoors or indoors, and a lot of times they want to cover with new fabric. Uh, for example, this customer wants to cover it with brand new fabric. Um, I think we have um, but anyway, so it'll be all brand new when it's done, but one of the requests that they uh, asked us to do was see this pillow is kind of low and they wanted to come up to higher. So we can do that because we're doing everything custom and, and um, we could even change the style. Even though this is a boxing um, cushion, if they wanted it just like knife edge or something like that, we can change that. If they want us to have a lower seat, we can do that. Uh, if they wanted one big cushion, we could do that. So pretty much they can request of anything for us to do. But in this case, the customer just basically asks us to recover and raise the cushions up to here, which we're gonna do. And we're gonna put it in this fabric here, which is really pretty. And then we're gonna make some pillows out of this floral fabric. And um, so that's what's going on with this furniture. Roma shade. <laughs> so we individually sew on these little rings to make sure that they're secure. Um, we use metal rings instead of plastic. A lot of the workrooms use plastic rings for their Roma shades, and we find that they get brittle over time and in the sun, and um, they can break. So you know, three four years from now, uh, they may not remember where they had it made or or maybe but you know we want to make sure that all of our products go out at the highest quality possible so we want every supply that we use every thread that we use the rings we use the highest quality supplies so that everything that goes out of here function properly and that the quality is at the, of, uh, the highest standards and you can see Kathy is hand sewing um, a lot of the workrooms, they just do very a lot of shortcuts and do zip zip, you know, machine sewing at certain levels. But certain things, if they, if you want it really precise and be really attached and have it measured precisely, you have to spend the time to do the hand sewing of the ends and the edges. And these, um, these, uh, uh, the Roman shade here, you don't even see the sewing marks because we actually, we actually do the taping, right? Okay, we tape it so it's very nice and smooth and there's no needles, points, or, or anything showing on the outside of the, so, I don't know if you have no, but anyway, so it's very smooth by the time it's, it's finished. You can see there's a, this, this, this shade is a very wide shade, which is unusual. And we don't normally recommend very wide shades because the mech, it puts a lot of strain on the mechanisms. So when we do a shade like this, we use more heavier duty 
mechanism so that it is able to withstand the, the strain of the heavy weight of the fabric. So when we, you know, with each shade or each product that we do, we may use different types of mechanisms or supplies to make sure that it's going to function properly. Like for this one, this shade is very wide, so by the time we roll it up, it's going to look like a Roman shade. Um, but it needs to make sure that it's hanging there properly. But you can see here, this is, this is so wide that, that one with the fabric is not able to cover it all. So there's actually a little bit of fabric here that we actually sewed it on, but the pattern matching is so precise that most of the time people don't even realize there's actually a seam there. And so, um, you know, we make sure the pattern matching is always spot on because that's one of the things that designers are always looking for to make sure that quality is there and we definitely um, work on that.